Welcome to Katameta Stories. Let's make garlic bread today. To half a cup of warm milk, add 2 tablespoons sugar, 1 teaspoon instant yeast and stir. Let this rest for 5 minutes for yeast to be activated. To 300 gram maida, add little salt, chili flakes, oregano and the yeast mixture. Mix thoroughly. Add little more milk till no more dry flour is seen. Knead the dough well. Your dough may look sticky but this is the right consistency. Add some oil and knead again. Apply little oil on the dough and let this rest for 2 hours or until the dough has doubled in size. Transfer onto a dusted surface and knead. Cut the dough into 4 equal parts. Make thin sheets from each part. Transfer one sheet onto a butter paper and apply some butter topped with chopped garlic, mozzarella cheese, oregano and chili flakes. Place another sheet on top of this and repeat with the remaining sheets. If you enjoy this video, don't forget to hit the like button and subscribe to my channel. Make 16 equal cuts on our roll dough. In the meantime, preheat the oven at 160 degrees centigrade. Twist two adjacent pieces and stick the ends together. Repeat with all the pieces and you will have 8 petals. Bake this for 20 to 25 minutes or until the top is brown. With same quantity, let's prepare garlic bread in kadai. Roll the kneaded dough. Apply some butter, add chopped garlic, mozzarella cheese, oregano and chili flakes. I am adding some boiled corn also. Fold the dough into half and seal the edges properly with little water. In the meantime, preheat a kadai with 2.5 cups of salt at medium heat for 15 minutes. Transfer the shaped dough onto a baking tray lined with butter paper and top with butter, chili flakes and oregano. Make few slits on the dough. Bake the dough in the kadai on medium heat for around 45 to 50 minutes or till top turns light brown. Enjoy your garlic bread with some cheese dips.